Hey filmmakers, Sean here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a DCP for free. So first, go to dcpomatic.com and download DCPomatic, which is a free software for DCP. Now we're going to go into DCPomatic, turn it on. And this is not as straightforward uh, as a software, so we do need to do a few steps. So first, go to new. And then we browse to where we want to have the folder. Choose papering, choose OK. And then name it papering. That's the name of the short film that I made. And press OK. Because it's already a made uh, DCP folder, it gives me this warning. But if you're just making a new folder, it won't show up this warning. And then press yes. And now add files. So add the final render of the short film. And now we can play the short film here and see through it. And we can see there is a bit of black bar on top and bottom. Not quite sure the reason for this, but we're gonna fix that quick here. So at scale here, we choose custom we can choose the correct one because it should be 2.39. Um, 2 that should be the correct uh, aspect ratio that I'm making it for, especially for the DCI output. That's OK. So now we don't have the two black uh, bars on top and bottom anymore. So if you have any issues uh, or if you have make your movie for 16 by 9 and you uh, need to make it fit better in your film without top and bottom black bars or side black bars you can adjust it here now for the rest you don't really have to do anything here because uh, most likely um, yeah your editing has already um, yeah pretty much done the audio and everything but you can double check it here but the next thing we need to do is go on top here and choose DCP. We're going to change a few things here. So I made a short film, so the content type should be a short. And then audio language uh, you kind of should add so they know it's a foreign movie or not. So my movie is um, Cantonese, so I choose here, edit, and then choose uh, you Chinese Cantonese and then press OK and for the rest here you don't really have to change much um, if you are doing 4k recommended would be go pump up the bit rate to 200 megabytes per second and if you're on 2k 150 megabytes per second should be fine and also really dependable on the festival uh, if you need to change this to flat or scope because it depends on the theater if they have a uh, flat projector or a, a scope projector or a mix of it and then the resolution is also dependable on festival and the theater and also of course the frame rate because my movie is uh, 24 frames and most um, yeah, festival should be fine with 24 frames and then to output your DCP you go to jobs and then make DCP if there's anything of issues or errors uh, or things you haven't done yet it will show up in this message and then you can hit make DCP to make a DCP and it should be in the same folder as where you place the yeah original uh, project and there should be the DCP folder that you need to copy and uh, send to the festival. So that was mainly it. Hope you found this a very interesting video. If you have any questions, please comment it here below. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.